This is Ty Dickinson. And Erica Lopez from the University of Oklahoma Weather Lab with your weekly regional forecast starting on Wednesday, February 28, 2017. Temperatures are finally looking somewhat consistent this week. Severe drought persists in some parts of the region, and the March outlook has been updated, so stay tuned for this week's briefing. Temperatures in the coming days will stay fairly consistent with highs in the 50s and 60s and lows in the 30s and 40s. Temperatures will warm into the 60s and 70s on Sunday and continue into the next week. Expect pleasant spring-like temperatures as meteorological spring begins. Virtually the entire cone has its probabilities of above normal temperatures next week. There is a large region with a 70% probability of above normal temperatures covering the majority of the plains and into the southwest. There is a small region in the Pacific Northwest with probabilities for below normal temperatures. The highest probability covers Washington State and is 50%. There has been several changes to the drought in the southeast U.S. Most of the regions of extreme drought have been downgraded to severe in the last week. Also, southern Oklahoma saw their dry rating removed. Moving east over to the Georgia region, in the last week an extreme region developed in the Birmingham metro area, while the rest of the region stayed relatively the same. Lastly, in Florida, the moderate drought region became slightly bigger, and dry conditions are now covering almost the entirety of the southern part of the peninsula. In the next week, there looks to be little precipitation for most of the southeast. However, southeast Texas has rain chances that could bring up to two inches of rain Saturday, while smaller amounts of rain extend into Louisiana and Mississippi. Looking into the next week, there are two regions of above and below normal amounts of precipitation. 33 to 40 percent probabilities for below normal precipitation are found in the southwest, heading northeast into the plains and in the southeast. The Pacific Northwest has the highest chance for above normal amounts of precipitation at 50 percent. 33 to 40 percent probabilities extend east towards the Great Lakes, and there is also a 33 percent region in the south Texas. Taking a look forward to the March outlook, most of the CONUS has probabilities of above normal temperatures. Most of Oklahoma and parts of West Texas and southwestern Kansas will see the highest probabilities at 60%. The rest of the country has a 33-50% to 50 chance of above normal temperatures, while the Pacific Northwest has probabilities of 33-40% to 40 for below normal temperatures in the next month. Continuing with the one-month outlook, precipitation for the western part of CONUS has probabilities between 33-50% to 50 for below normal. Parts of the Pacific Northwest have probabilities of 33-50% to 50%, and the Great Lakes region has probabilities of 33-40% to 40% for above normal precipitation. Once again, this has been your forecast brought to you by the University of Oklahoma Weather Lab, a top academic weather and research program in the United States and partner of the Southern Climate Impacts Planning Program. Watch for your forecast Wednesdays on the Oklahoma Weather Lab channel on YouTube.